normal. Looks normal. And it even drives normal, but the eight-cylinder engine in this Ford van is anything but. This is the first over-the-road vehicle running on catalytic ignition and 35% water ethanol fuel mixture. You heard right. This engine, with only minor changes, runs on ethanol and water. It's very strange. Most people sell products to get water out of your tank. But in this case, the water is an important additive that stretches the ethanol and lets it burn at a lower temperature. The advantage of this technology is clearly seen coming from the tailpipe. The emissions are 90% less polluting than from a normal vehicle. Idaho's Simplot Company is a producer of ethanol. It's expensive because it's not in high demand. Despite that, the water ethanol mix in this engine costs about as much as regular gas, and the mileage it gets is almost as good. So why aren't automakers beating a path to Idaho and opening their minds to ethanol? I think it's one of those things Detroit may not be really interested in listening to. It would put some of their technology out of existence. It's like a huge tanker. Uh, you can begin to turn the rudder, but it's a few miles later before the tanker actually makes the corner. If Detroit isn't interested, the military is. The Defense Department is funding research to the tune of nearly $400,000. Now, if only he can catch the ear of Detroit. Roland Barris, Idaho's News Channel 7.